Hi, I'm George Spicer, and I have a word of encouragement for you. Matt Marr is a popular singer-songwriter, and he has written a song that I think is appropriate for the time we live in. It begins like this. It don't have a job. It won't pay your bills. Won't buy you a home in Beverly Hills. Won't fix your life in five easy steps. Ain't the law of the land or the government but it's all you need. Well, what is it? It happens to be God's love. And who better than God to describe his love? In Exodus 34, we read, The Lord, the Lord, the compassionate and gracious God, slow to anger, abounding in love and faithfulness, maintaining love to thousands, and forgiving wickedness, rebellion, and sin. We find in Psalm 61 that David is at a place where he wants and needs to rest in God's love. It's believed that Psalm 61 was written at a time when David was trying to put down a rebellion which was led by his own son. There are two verses in particular that have given me a lot of comfort, verses 3 and 4. For you have been my refuge, a strong tower against the foe. I long to dwell in your tent forever and to take refuge in the shelter of your wings. David writes that he wants to dwell in God's tent forever. Well, tent is another word for tabernacle, and that's the place where God was. And David wants to be with God. He wants to be near God. And then he writes that he would take shelter or refuge in the shelter of your wings which is simply just another way of describing God's tender care for his people. Now, times are tough. So many concerns right now. Will I have a job? Will I have money to make the rent, buy food for my family? Don't forget, my friends, you have a God who cares for you. And so seek his shelter. And you have a God who is near to you, so shelter in his love. We're going to get through this, and God will see us through this. I love the phrase, hold us together. Maybe better said today, may God hold you together. So we pray. Gracious God, like David, we need your comfort. We need your love. Calm our anxious hearts, remove our fears, help us to rest in the shelter of your wings, knowing that you are near to us. Help us to trust more firmly so that we might believe in you above all that we're going through now. In your name, amen. Well, thanks for joining me. I'll be back on Friday at 8 o'clock for another word of encouragement. Until then, God bless your week. Bye-bye now.